Hey everybody, my name is Prime Thorn. Welcome to another video of mine. Today we'll be doing tips and tricks of the operator known as Bastion of the French Raid Team. Bastion is a support operator, so let's first look at this video explaining what the support operator role does. The support is like the sword's edge. A support fighter doesn't just attack, he also defends. They have the highest health and the toughest armor. Their job is to draw the enemy's attention and to pin down their opponents. The support doesn't kill. They prevent the enemy from killing and keep the battlefield under control. Support cannot be ignored. Let's talk what Bastion has with him. He has a Glock 18 primary full auto submachine pistol and a shield. He can either equip the sidearm by itself, equip both the shield and the sidearm together, or just the shield itself. You will most likely just use the sidearm and the shield, or just the shield itself. There are few, very few times you will use the shield. Now, let's talk about his Glock 18C. Up close, it's a beast, but medium to long range, it will not do so well. It starts out with a 18 round magazine, but then you will get a 26 round magazine later. Make sure if you're going to use the Glock, Use the one you know you can push the enemy and put them down. Remember, there is no melee in this game, so you can't just use your shield, since it would be useless. Now, let's talk about the shield. The shield is very effective at protecting your teammates for either revives or assaulting the enemy. The shield will only protect your body, arms, and head, but not your legs. So if you stand to move towards the enemy, your legs will expose and can be shot at, which can be put you down. You can sprint... You can't, or sorry, my bad. You can't sprint with only the shield equipped, but you can sprint with both the shield and the sidearm equipped. Now remember, you can't sprint very fast since the sport is the slowest class for sprinting. But you do have armor and health that make up for it with the three armor slots and the 120 health points. He does not have any explosives or smokes like most of the operators does. Now, his ability is called backup. Now, the ability states that when used, the operator applies the inspired effect to allies within the effect radius behind the operator. The operator cannot sprint and slows down in all conditions by 5%. Inspired is basically uh, incoming damage is decreased by 20%. Now, when you use this ability, you will slow down and you will gain the same amount of damage. But whoever is in your cone behind you will be taking 20% less damage. The ability will only help your teammates, but never yourself. Be aware of that. He is very good if you can adjust your pushing and be able to be near your teammates because that's where he is the most effective. If you try to go solo on people, then you won't have a good chance of winning. This game is... This is a team game, and Bastion is a perfect library to display this. Now, some good tips is to use a shield around corners to spot enemies for your teammates and also to crouch when shooting the sidearm to gain the most effective accuracy with the sidearm. When up close, use the hip fire while using the shield to be very effective and down enemies quickly while you're protected. Always stick with either your medic or your sniper to protect them the most because they are the most effective on the battlefield. I would say assault, but they like to go ahead of everyone most of the time because they're tip of the spear. Conserve your stamina, don't always run unless it's with your teammates or to use the stamina consumables when you have to catch up or use your stamina to be with them. That's Now that's all I can think of. If you have any more tips or tricks for Bastion, leave a comment down below and if you like this video, give it a like. I stream on Twitch from 2pm Eastern Standard Time to whenever. Feel free to give me a follow. Um, to let you know that this video was obviously scripted and a little bit more different, I hope this will be a lot more better to understand for you, and I hope this is better for you. I hope you all have a wonderful day, and stay safe out there. Peace.